Today on MTG Unpacked, we're putting together more snack packs for patrons. So we're continuing from where we left off this morning. So this is for April 2019. And to do the pack blessing duties if required, we have Jace here. So let's move him aside and we'll pull him in again if he's needed. All right, so the first patron today is Lou Jukes. So good luck, Lou. Let's hope we can get you some good pulls today. All right, so as per usual, <laughs> right off the bat, a wild card. Okay, so you know the drill. I'll grab you an extra rare here. Okay, let's set that aside. <laughs> and here's a funny one. So we get a... Oh, I thought that was a garbage fire. No, it is Fire Urchin. So let's get a closer look here. If we cannot focus, we have ongoing focus problems here. Let's see if we can get that close enough. Okay, so Fire Urchin. I thought that was actually garbage fire, but I was mistaken. Abandon Hope, so I think this one is from Tempest. Pretty cool old card. Goblin Instigator Creature Goblin Rogue, one one for two mana. Crypt Cobra, some cool artwork on that one. Uh, what is that, Mirage? Very nice, and Uncommons we have Circuitous Route. Thran Dynamo. Wonder if that's still worth a buck or two. I'll find out during editing. Mirrodin's Core. Theft of Dreams. So this one's from Exodus. Very cool. True Fire Captain. And the first of your foils is Merchant's Dockhand. Artifact Creature Construct. One, two for one mana. So this is a rare. Pay three in blue. Tap. Tap X, untap artifacts you control. You get to look at the top X cards of your library, put one of them into your hand and rest on the bottom of your library in any order. And your second foil is also a rare, Collective Effort. Sorcery for three has Escalate. So tap and untap creature you control. Pay this cost for each mode chosen beyond the first. So choose one or more, destroy target creature with power four or greater destroy target enchantment. Put a plus one plus one counter on each creature target player controls. Alright, and your rare, or first rare I should say, is Regisaur Alpha, Creature Dinosaur 4-4 four, four, for 5 mana. Other dinosaurs you control have haste, nice. When it enters battlefield, credit is 3-3 green dinosaur creature token with trample. Who is a fan of the dinos? Leave a note in the comments. And we also get this nasty looking Chasm Skulker, Creature Squid Horror, 1-1 one, one for 3 mana. Whenever you draw a card, put a plus one plus one counter on Chasm Skulker. When it dies, put X, one mum blue, squid creature tokens with Island Walk. Craziness. Onto the battlefield where X is the number of plus one plus one counters on Chasm Skulker. Alright, so some nice pulls there today for you, Lou. Thank you for being a patron. Alright, next we have whoop, multiple packs there. You mad bra 99 and then as you can see he's already got a couple of nice pulls there. Let's see what else we can get for you this month. Okay, we'll dig in. No wild card first off. We gotta save those. Alright, so some cool artwork here. Scent of Jasmine. I'm not sure what set that is, if we can ever get it in focus. Seems to be a problem. Okay. Will any number of white cards in your hand, you gain two life for each card revealed this way. I'd like to get a close-up of the artwork. There we go, finally. Alright, sorry about that. Wrap in flames. Retromancer, <laughs> Ray of Erasure, this one's from Ice Age, Acruan Crusader, Uncommon's Whirler Maker, Bloodbraid Elf, I think that might be worth a few bucks, not sure, Lava Coil, there's a good one, Ajani's Pride Mate, 
Purnimaton. And first foil here is Ether Poisoner. I like the lighting on that one. Shimmer Scale Drake. And the rare is Thought Not Seer. Nice creature Eldrazi 4-4 for 4 mana. So that symbol represents colorless mana. When it enters the battlefield, target opponent rules his or her hand. You choose a non-land card from it and exile that card. When Thought Not Seer leaves the battlefield, target opponent draws a card. Love the artwork on this dude. Look at that eyeball thing. Very strange. All right, so there you go. You mad, bra 99. Thank you for being a patron once again. All right, moving right along, we have Kim R. Let's see what we can get you this month, Kim. Okay, let's dig in here. What is this? We have a frantic search for focus. Once again. Okay. Faithless looting from Ultimate Masters. Frantic search again. <laughs> That's crazy. Phantom Warrior. So I'm not sure what set that is. Uh, Weatherlight maybe? Conviction. Retreat to Hagra. First the uncommons here. A Johnny's welcome. Cradle Guard from Urza's. Summon Tree Folk. Heckling Fiends. Ring of Colonia. And Foil Nanam Cobra. That's pretty cool. Kelden Halberdier. And the rare is a mythic. Yes, you got a planeswalker, Soren Grim Nemesis. Six loyalty for six mana. His plus one. Reveal the top card of your library and put that card into your hand. Each opponent loses life equal to its converted mana cost. Minus X. He deals X damage to target creature or planeswalker, and you gain X life. Minus nine. Put a number of one one black vampire knight creature tokens with life link onto the battlefield equal to the highest life total among all players. Nice pull there. Congratulations, Kim. Thank you for being a patron, and what are people thinking of War of the Spark with all of these new Planeswalkers? Every pack will have a Planeswalker. That is insanity. It's going to be curious to see how that pans out. Next patron we have Jack of All Trades. Good luck, sir. Alright, let's dig in. And we start off here with a Skywing Avon, Bird Soldier, Mana Geyser, Fire Urchin again, Seagate Oracle, Spider Umbra, Remorseful Cleric. So this is a bonus rare here, Speecher, Speecher, Creature, Spirit Cleric, 2-1 for 2 mana with flying, sack him, XL all cards from target players at Graveyard. And uncommons we have Skyship Plunderer, Mistvale vale Plains. And seriously, you people are cleaning out the rares. Okay, let's do this thing. So we will grab another rare, spirit it back there, and I got a peek at it. I'm sure some others did as well, but if you're watching this live, you might not be able to see what it was. Next uncommons we have Disappearing Act, Balduvian Horde. And foil, oh actually that was a, sorry, that was a foil, look at that, very nice. And then this one was even better, Aradara Express, look at that foiling, fantastic. And a mythic, Omniscience, Enchantment 410, you may cast spells from your hand without paying their mana costs. Very nice, and that goes along with a mythic, Domri Chaos Bringer. Legendary Planeswalker Domri, 5 loyalty for 4 mana. His plus 1 is add red or green. If that mana is spent on a creature spell, it gains Riot. Minus 3, look at the top 4 cards of your library. You may reveal up 2 creature cards from among them. Put them into your hand, put the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. And his ultimate minus 8, you get an emblem with that at the beginning of each end step. Create a 4-4 four, four red and green beast creature token with trample. And there's Domri and his piggies ready for battle. And if you have seen some of the spoilers for War of the Spark, you know what happens with Domri. I'm not going to spoil it here, but yeah, that's uh, rather interesting. Thank you for being a patron, Jack of all trades. 
Next up we have Travis Taylor. Good luck, sir. Alrighty. <laughs> I am getting rather good at pulling those. I swear there's not that many in there, but... Okay, standard pack it is. Today you get a Guilds of Ravnica, blessed by Jace. I hope that's okay. If not, well, sorry about that. So, standard pack. Let's move that over there. Jace will keep track of those for us. Next we have a Fighting Drake Double Cleave, Doomed Traveller, Torment of Venom, Uncommons, we have a Cool Battle Sliver, Tezzeret's Touch, Garner the Blood Flame, you're cleaning me out, I swear, <laughs> okay, another standard pack, Corset 2019, I think you got both of the standard pack cards here, alright, so... Another standard pack. Uh, craziness. Dusk Legion Dreadnought. And a foil in Bolus's Clutches. There's Liliana. And a Tali Primal Storm. Nice. Legendary creature. Elder Dinosaur 664. Six mana. Whenever it attacks, it sells the top card of each player's library. Then you may cast any number of non land cards that sell this way without paying their mana cost. Dirty Big Dino. And a Metallic Mimic. Artifact creature shapeshifter 2 1 for 2. As it enters the battlefield, choose a creature type. If it, uh, it's a chosen type in addition to its other types, each other creature you control as a chosen type enters the battlefield with an additional plus 1 plus 1 counter on it. And love the artwork on that one. Very cool. Alright, let's crack some packs here, people. Core 2019. I hope I have enough packs set aside there. Okay, we have Anticipate, an AK Ogre, Inspired Charge, Infectious Horror, Highland Game, Naturalize, Strangling Spores, Marauder's Axe, Shock, and for the Uncommons we have Thud, Draconic Disciple, Lightning Strike, and the rare is Sigiled Sword of Valoron, Artifact Equipment for 3. Quick creature gets plus two plus zero, has vigilance, and is a knight in addition to its other types. Whenever a quick creature attacks, create a two to white knight creature token with vigilance that's attacking. Quick cost is three. All right, and you also get a foil, a risk, a swift claw, creature cat warrior, and a forest and a soldier token. All right, so let's double check here. I don't think anything else was over a buck. So we'll set those aside. Guilds of Ravnica next. Good luck, sir. We have Barging Sergeant, 10th District Guard, Leapfrog. And I'm grabbing multiple cards here. Child of Night, Urban Utopia, Command Storm, Mephitic Vapors, Luminous Bonds, Lenardi Shieldmate, Piston Fist Cyclops, and Uncommons, you get a Goblin Crater Maker, Creature Goblin Warrior, 2-2 two, two for 2, Grappling Sundu, Okran Assassin, and you get a Mythic! Nice Thousand Year Storm, Enchantment for 6, whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, copy it for each other instant and sorcery spell you've cast before at this turn. You may choose new targets for the copies, and Admir Gilgate, and a Soldier Token. Alright, so... There we go, Travis. Let's arrange things like so. Tuck that in here. Thanks for being a patron once again. Onward, Neil Ellis. Good luck, sir. All right, let's see what we can get for Neil today. Move this box out of the way there. We have a Pillarfield Ox, Macabre Waltz with Liliana there, Dancing with a Zombie, Moment of Heroism, Defy Gravity, Martyr of Sands, and Uncommons we have the Flame of Keld, Hidden Stockpile, Settle the Score, Liliana again, Warcry Phoenix, Make Obsolete, and your foil here is Bewilder, and a nice foil Plains from Kaladesh. And the rare is Helm of the Host, Legendary Artifact Equipment for 4. 
At the beginning of combat on your turn, create a token that's a copy of equipped creature, except the token isn't legendary. If equipped creature is legendary, that token gains haste. Equip cost is five. Some nice artwork on that one. All right, there we go, Neil. Thank you for being a patron once again. And onward we go to, I think we have, what, three more left? Yep. Benjamin Sullivan, as you can see, he took part in the Chaos Mystery Box this month with his foil Ajani there. Very cool. So good luck, sir. Let's dig in for Benjamin. Okay, we start off with a Akruan Crusader. Wants to focus on everything else all the time. All right. Barishi. What on earth is a Barishi? Looks like a weird bush on top of a sheep. I don't know what that is. If you know what it is, leave it out in the comments. Think twice. And an extra rare. Yes, the rares are raining from the heavens today. Let's grab an extra rare there for you, sir. And Jace will hold another one. Thank you, Jace. We have Gateway Plaza. And then moving on to the uncommons, we have Charter Course. I think that one was pretty decent. Mind crank. What is going on here? That looks rather disturbing. Visionary Augmenter. Pima Aetherseer. Fountain of Renewal. And your foil is Impassioned Orator. Another foil behind the scenes. And first of your two rares, Pelt Collector, creature Elphoria 1-1 one, one for a single green. Whenever another creature you control enters the battlefield or dies, if that creature's power is greater than Pelt Collector's, put a plus one, plus one counter on Pelt Collector as long as Pelt Collector has three or more plus one, plus one counters on it. It has Chapel. And your second rare is Wear of Invention, instant for X and three blue. Has Improvise, search your library for an artifact card with convert amount cost X or less, put it onto battlefield, then shuffle your library. Alrighty, there we go, Benjamin. Thank you for being a patron once again. And I hope you enjoy your nice pile of cards there with your Ajani gold main. Next we have Alpha Elizaga. Good luck. Okay, let's see what we can get for you, Alpha, this month. We start off with... Ornamental Courage. Nature's Claim. For a second I thought that was another Jackalope card there. Hurly Burly. Stasis Cell. Thermo Alchemist. Appetite for Brains. Delightful. A Braid. There's a nice one from Hour of Devastation. Mantis Engine. What the heck? That's some cool artwork. I uh, can never remember what that set name is. If you know what it is, leave it in the chat or in the comments. Sleight of Hand. Miraculous Recovery. Uh, yeah, that was just a regular. And a Foil Rare Angler Turtle. Creature Turtle. 5, 7 for 7 mana has Hexproof. Creatures your opponents control attack each combat if able. Second Foil is Faithless Looting. It's pretty cool. And the rare is Thorn Lieutenant, creature Elphoria 2 3 for 2 mana. Whenever Thorn Lieutenant becomes target of a spell or ability, an opponent controls create a 1 1 green Elphoria creature token. And for 5 and green, it gets plus 4 plus 4 until end of turn. Alright, so there we go, Alpha. I hope you enjoy those. Thank you for being a patron once again. Okay, and finally, for this video today, we have KDW. Good luck, I hope we can get you some nice pulls today. Okay, let's dig into it. And remember, tomorrow, same times, I think, hopefully, 
Uh, we'll have two more videos with the remaining patron snap packs, so stay tuned for that. Okay, Reckless Scholar, Academy Drake, Totem Guide, Heart to Beast, Lotus Eye Mystics, Turn to Mist, and Uncommons. We have Desperate Ritual, Lightning Mare, it's pretty cool, Sultai Flayer, On Sarah's Wings, Village Messenger, Flips into a Moonrise Intruder, so that's from Shadows Over Innistrad. Oh, nice, a foil, Path to Exile. Foil Awful Snout, which looks pretty awful, if you ask me. And the rare is Foreboding Ruins. It's a land, as it enters the battlefield, you may reveal a Swamp or Mountain card from your hand. If you don't, Foreboding Ruins enters the battlefield tapped. And you can tap, add black or red to your mana pool. There we go. That is it today, Katie. Thank you for being a patron once again. And if you too would like to be a patron like these fine patrons here, I'll leave a link to the Empty Gem Pat Patreon in the description for this video. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings. And be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. And I hope you'll stick around for the remaining patron videos tomorrow. Thanks for watching and have a great day.